My name is Charles Falk. I'm an associate professor here in the Department of Computer Science at UC Irvine. And my general area of research and teaching is in computer vision, so getting the machine to make sense of what's in images. For a while now, I've been collaborating with a group at Caltech doing imaging in neuroscience. And so this is a, a project which is trying to sort of map out the control circuitry of the heart. Of course, uh, you know, people have problems, so heart disease is a big uh, health issue in the United States. It affects millions of people, and so there's lots of interest in that. And so this uh, is a project that's funded by NIH, National Institutes of Health, under a program that's generally trying to understand peripheral nervous system, and in particular, uh, neurons that innervate different organs in your body. And, uh, our specific project is, is a, a large collaboration, so it involves a group of scientists that are all looking at different aspects of that system. For a long time, hundreds of years, people have been sort of drawing anatomical diagrams, trying to figure out where do the nerves run through your body, and so we sort of have the, the big picture of what those systems are coming from your central nervous system headed out to the heart. And the idea of this project is to sort of bring all those pieces together and really build a, a much more detailed map. If we could sort of really map out those circuits in detail, then you could imagine uh, kind of analyzing, okay, what's going wrong? Why do I have this particular arrhythmia? And saying, well, it, it must be that this particular feedback signal is out of sync. The anatomical mapping is sort of where our group comes in, uh, in that the, the way you understand that anatomy is by collecting images photograph you take with your camera maybe is 20 megabytes if it's a nice high resolution image. Uh, here we're taking sort of images which are of that resolution but now at many many different depths through a, a 3D volume and so we end up with sort of 3D images which are maybe hundreds of gigabytes or terabyte uh, for these large volumes and we'd like to sort of build tools to be able to automatically process that data and sort of trace out where the neurons are running in 3D through that volume and sort of put together that information about the, the sort of local anatomy along with these other kinds of measurements of the biochemistry and electrical activity and so on to really figure out sort of what these systems are doing. How, how does the regulation really work? Lots to learn there, lots to understand.